In March last year, the Constitutional Court ruled that the Hawks was not independent enough. This followed litigation by businessman Hugh Glenister on the 2008 scrapping of the Scorpions. It was then back to the drawing board for SAPS. The amendment bill is now before Parliament and the legislature will get more power over remuneration and policy. We have removed those from the inter-ministerial committee, which was one of the gravest disquiets of the constitutional court judgment. And given that inter-ministerial committee, much more of just a coordinating function. The Hawks boss will decide on operations and not the National Police Commissioner. Anwad Ramat will head the team until the bill is passed and then he'll have to reapply for the position. Complaints about undue political pressure can be taken to a retired judge. Kasak believes the proposed changes aren't enough. It has to be a step in the right direction because they are aiming to, to, to satisfy the requirements of the Constitutional Court in Glenister. Uh, whether it goes far enough in, in terms of doing that, uh, we, we're not yet sure, sure and we will have to look in more detail as to whether it meets the minimum requirements set out in Glenister. Public hearings start at the end of April. Abra Barbia, SABC News, Parliament.